What's going on guys? Welcome to the next weekly ramble video. Today I've only got a few things to talk about, but I do want to go into some detail on some of them. Uh, so we will hopefully fill the 10 to 15 minutes that we normally do these, uh, but some interesting stuff coming up for the channel. The first of which, uh, I've already been talking about the last couple weeks, we're doing guest appearances on the podcast, or we at least plan to. Uh, we're in testing phases right now, but the plan is August 1st, uh, we're going to have our good friend Andrew, who, as you know, is our print guy. He's done a lot of awesome stuff for us, including the posters that are now for sale, as well as some of the t-shirts, the cup that we gave away very, very early on. Uh, he screen printed that. He's done quite a lot for us. Uh, he's also a magic player. He, ha he loves the game. Uh, and so he had an idea of doing an episode based off of proxies, uh, counterfeit cards, things like that, uh, which is obviously kind of a divided topic. Obviously, fake cards in a tournament setting is something that I don't think anybody wants, but uh, we are going to talk about that a little bit more in depth and basically where proxies are acceptable, where they're not, uh, what makes them acceptable, and when is sort of the line breach there. So uh, August 1st, I think, is our tentative date for that. Uh, obviously, if we end up not being able to do it at that time, uh, we'll let you guys know probably about a week in advance. It'll probably be on the weekly ramble video, but uh, the plan is to do it August 1st. So we've got one more episode uh, next week, and then the week after that should be uh, our first setup with a guest appearance, which we're really excited about. This is something, obviously, we wanted to do. Uh, Andrew is the first one for multiple reasons. One, he already had a topic in mind, uh, which is great. He's very knowledgeable about that topic, so we wanted to bring him in and talk about it. Uh, second, because he is a friend of ours, he, he's sort of the guinea pig, uh, and Andrew, I know you're going to watch this. You're the guinea pig, buddy, but uh, I'm really excited about it because it's a good topic. Uh, obviously, you have a lot of weight on it, uh, and so I'd like to get that out there a little bit. That's not something we've ever touched on, so I think it's a great topic. Uh, again, really excited to have him on, and then obviously subsequent guests later on. Uh, our, our plan, I believe, is to try and do one a month, like towards the end of the month. Uh, obviously this is sort of in the beginning of the month on this one, but this is sort of our test. So we'll see how things go. Uh, hopefully everything goes really well. I'm excited about this though. Uh, and Andrew seems really stoked about being on the podcast as well. Uh, and again, thank you to him for doing all of the print stuff up until now and continuing that. Uh, but then also participating in this and being kind of the first to, uh, to give this a shot. So should be pretty fun. Uh, the next thing I wanted to talk about. A new versus video is uh, scheduled to come out next week. I'm actually still in the editing process. Uh, it takes quite a while. If you've seen our Instagram or anything like that, you know that I think it took me seven hours to get the first two minutes fleshed out completely. Uh, and that was just the intro. So <laughs> it's a lot of work. Uh, thankfully, we did have some outside help to do some B-roll footage. Uh, our good friend Julius, who... I don't believe we've ever talked about on the channel, but he's actually uh, helped us out with some B-roll footage, so thank you to him. Uh, and the plan is to have that edited and finished hopefully by this weekend, uh, and then potentially Tuesday, I believe, is going to be the release date. We'll see how that goes. Uh, it's just a lot of work to get that edited, so I just have to spend some more time with it. Uh, but that is the plan. It's actually going to be a really exciting video, I think. If you saw the first one, you know that it was really a step above anything that we had ever tried before. It was much more produced, uh, sort of a multi-camera setup, and then bouncing back and forth between shots, things like that. Uh, doing some post commentary that sort of uh, intercepted into the gameplay itself. It was actually a lot more commentary driven. Uh, this time we're trying to focus a little bit more on the gameplay. Uh, unfortunately, just due to the infrastructure that we have with cameras and things like that, we don't have the best setup for it. So we're doing the best we can with what we have. Uh, but we're trying to extend this one out a little bit more, make it more enjoyable uh, and a little bit more in-depth on a turn-by-turn -turn basis. So uh, very, very excited to have that released. Uh, I've already talked to a few people also uh, about uh, promoting that. And so I just want to go ahead and thank G2K Games uh, as well as Cardsphere for working with us a little bit uh, to help promote that. Um, but yeah, super exciting. Hopefully you guys will see that up on Tuesday. If not, obviously we will let you know somewhere uh, that it's running a little bit late, but it should be next week sometime. Uh, so be on the lookout for that. Uh, and then the last thing that I wanted to talk about is something, and wow, we are way ahead of schedule. Sorry, guys. Uh, but the last thing I wanted to talk about is something that is very much in the process and the planning processes right now, uh, but something that we're really excited about. Uh, will, as some of you may know, is a very big D&D &D fan. 
Uh, I've only played once, and I'll be honest. Sorry to sorry to uh, annoy anybody out there, but uh, I'm not the biggest D and D fan. But Will swears this is the way he's gonna get me into it. So we're gonna see what happens. But the plan is, um, we actually have a D and D campaign that he is working on right now. In fact, I think he's got most of it written up until you know as far as he can get with it, at least. Uh, and I believe the plan is we're going to start recording this uh, with a few other friends. Zach Latham, friend of ours, he's been on the stream before. Uh, and then another friend who I've actually not met yet. This is Will's friend. His name is Jake. He should be on the uh, the D&D campaign as well. We're going to do a three-camera setup. We've got a whole lot of planning involved in this that we're going to put down. Hopefully pre-record these so that way we can do these once a month kind of uh, in advance. <coughs> Excuse me. So... Um, our hope is to start getting that out within the next couple months. That's a little ways away, but I just wanted to go ahead and give somewhat of a heads up to it. Uh, something else that we think might be kind of fun that Will has been working on, this is very much Will's kind of pet project, uh, and he's doing a lot of awesome stuff with it. So uh, we want to do sort of a behind the scenes thing, uh, which is something that we've not really done before. Uh, we've posted little clips of us doing stuff, but nothing sort of produced and like, hey, this is what we're doing. This is kind of how things go. Uh, we've never done that before. And so uh, Will wants to sort of be able to record the character building, uh, the planning processes, things like that. He wants to have all of that footage to be able to go in and edit and actually create sort of a behind the scenes video of how we do what we do uh, and how we set up this D&D campaign. So if that goes well, that might be something we go into uh, with some of our versus videos as well. Obviously, again, those being a little bit more produced as well as this D&D campaign, uh, we want to make it, uh, we want to build some hype around it. We want to make it exciting and letting you guys see the back end process of that uh, seems like a good way to sort of be a little bit more transparent and hopefully build a little bit of hype because obviously it's an exciting thing for us to do and hopefully it's exciting for you guys to watch. So that's kind of the plan. Uh, again, we don't have an actual set date to start this campaign. Uh, but we're thinking hopefully by the beginning of September, I believe, uh, is when we're going to shoot for having the first uh, installment of that out. Uh, that's going to be fairly long form content, obviously, because it is a D&D &D campaign. So we'll probably uh, have hour long videos roughly, uh, give or take a little bit. Um, but basically, we'll all sit down, we'll play through uh, a session of the campaign, and then obviously we'll do our best to make it exciting and pretty and, you know, all that jazz. So uh, pretty excited about that. The hook with it, uh, now that I've rambled on for way too long, uh, is that it's set in Ravnica. Uh, we're actually doing a campaign set in the MTG universe. Uh, and that is, again, the way that he swears I'm going to love D&D. So uh, we've already talked a little bit about the, the storyline without him giving anything away. Uh, he's planning to record some videos giving some information about the story. I have promised I cannot watch them, uh, but he knows to post them and do all that stuff. So probably the lead up to the first episode, uh, maybe the week, two weeks, something like that beforehand, we'll probably have some videos going up to sort of build some hype around it. Uh, so just so you're aware, be on the lookout for that. Again, late August, probably into September is when that first episode is going to come out. Uh, I did also want to mention, I forgot to put this out there, for the Versus videos. Uh, this is obviously only our second one. We've waited a few months to do this. A plan of ours is to actually start uh, doing these hopefully once a month. That's really our goal. Uh, obviously, it takes a lot of editing and a lot of uh, just time to sort of get everything shot. It usually takes a number of hours to get the gameplay shot, the commentary shot, uh, a lot of the B-roll stuff taken care of. So uh, it does take a while, but the plan is to shoot for once a month for these. That's very loose, I will say. Uh, we do not have a set schedule for any of this, uh, including the D&D campaign, although we're going to try and get a, a set schedule up for that, I believe, as soon as we can. Uh, but for the Versus videos, we do not have a set, set schedule. So uh, hopefully we're going to be able to get them out once a month. Obviously, uh, something that is kind of tough on us is that we both have full-time jobs. Uh, so it's not like we can just sit down and you know produce all these every single day. Uh, generally, after work, I've only got a few hours to edit, and then I've got other stuff going on. So uh, it's a little bit tougher for us to get this content out there. But it is something that we're excited about and that we're really proud of because, again, it's it's a lot more produced, including the D&D campaign. The plan is to make this a lot more produced, uh, much higher quality than just our normal videos, 
Uh, and so something that hopefully excites you guys and shows to you guys that we're really trying to put in an effort with this. Uh, we, we've made very uh, not cost-effective strides <laughs> uh, to try and get good quality for uh, not only the podcast, but crack -a pack videos, things like that. Um, none of it has been cost effective for us. I will just go ahead and say, <laughs> um, but it's fun and it's something that, you know, we really enjoy and we want to put the time and the effort into. And so we're willing to kind of take the hit on costs a little bit. If it means that we get a better produced and a better piece of content that you guys can hopefully enjoy. So, uh, that is definitely on the radar. I will say, look out for the versus video next week. Look out for the D and D campaign, uh, over the next month or so. Uh, and some hype videos to kind of go along with that. The last thing I want to mention, we're actually going to try one more thing uh, with giveaways coming up very soon. So as you guys know, we do giveaways probably once a month, uh, generally towards the, be the end of one month and the beginning of the other, kind of that crossover week. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, and we do run them for a week. So usually it's Sunday or Monday to the following Monday. Uh, if we decide to release a little bit early, sometimes we'll put it up on Sunday. But the plan is for this one, uh, we're going to give away based on Twitter followers, which we've never done before. We've never actually breached into Twitter that much. We have one. Uh, follow it, I guess, in the link down below. Uh, but we've actually never really given anything away to our Twitter followers. And so something that we want to do is build that up a little bit. Uh, it's not only to, to show that we can build this kind of a thing and hopefully interact with you guys a little bit more. Uh, it's really just some, it's another way to, to build our platform and hopefully communicate a little more directly because Instagram, while fun and exciting and kind of nice in the sense that you can do imagery and videos and stuff like that. I like the fact that you can just post a very quick little message on Twitter and hopefully get some feedback on it. And so if we have any updates, if we have any ideas that we want to run by you guys, uh, Twitter will probably be our new way to do it. Uh, and so that's kind of the plan going forward. Our next giveaway is going to be for Twitter. Obviously, the normal ones will still continue. A lot of the time, we either do Instagram only or YouTube only, stuff like that. Uh, but I just wanted to give you guys a heads up. In case you want to go ahead and follow, you're welcome to. There will be some other thing that you have to do to actually enter uh, with a hashtag. Um, I don't know. Uh, but we should be giving away a Magic 2019 corset bundle. I believe that's what we're going to be giving away. So get excited about that. Uh, again, we like to throw a lot of value as much as we can into these giveaways. Uh, they're a big boost for us and something that we can do to kind of give back directly to people. So uh, keep an eye on that. That'll be coming up in the next week or so. Uh, so if you want to go ahead and follow, go ahead and do it. Save yourself some time later on. Uh, but uh, I think that's going to wrap up this video. It was a little bit shorter. Uh, not really, actually. <laughs> we rambled a bit. Uh, gotta love the weekly ramble. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please make sure to leave a like or a comment down below. Uh, if you have any questions for us about the new upcoming content, by all means, let us know down in there in the comment section. And obviously, if you have any suggestions, what we can do, what we can do better, uh, let us know. We're, we're really interested to know. Uh, thank you to everybody who's watching, and thank you to Andrew uh, for, for working with us on the next uh, guest appearance podcast episode. But with that, I'm going to get out of here. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next weekly ramble.